Uh, he's a pacifist. He doesn't believe in violence or of any kind or guns or whatever. So he's sort of like the opposite of of Tallahassee and, and, and probably the opposite of anything that is probably going to keep you alive. Shockingly, he has remained alive. No, I don't know why. Um, through his song, let's say. Um, although that would have just attracted zombies to him. I don't know. He uh, he made it for some for some reason, and uh, and he gets picked up by Little Rock and Wichita, and then uh, yeah, he kind of like tries to explain to Little Rock about like pacifist ideas and the ideas of you know nonviolence uh, in a world full of zombies because that makes a lot of sense. And Little Rock sort of listens, sort of, um, but um, you know she's still she's still Little Rock, so. She likes her guns. Yeah, yeah I think I think that the, the you know the thing that makes this different than all the other zombie um, things that are out there is that it's uh, it's aware of itself. It knows it knows the genre so well that it can play with the genre and play around with the tropes within the genre. Um, and it's just got a really stellar cast. Like everyone's so talented, and and, and everyone's like you know firing on all cylinders, and and very fun, and completely funny, and um, and so yeah, and so that uh, that 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 I think ultimately makes it quite quite different than um, than other zombie things. It's just funny, you know. There's so so the zombie stuff got so serious, you know, and I like my serious zombie stuff, but it, it, it's it's every once in a while you need to take a step back and like have a more of a funnier outlook on that kind of like horror, you know, zombie thing. So I think that that does as well. I'm surprised by how sentimental it is. You know, it's it's very funny, but it's like really got a lot of heart, and and the and the characters and their relationships uh, that have evolved since the original. And um, it talks about like some really kind of complicated relationship stuff. You know, actually, rather than um, you know like comedies that sort of like kind of skirt around that sort of thing. Like we have our big moments of like people getting together, people coming, you know, coming together, and and and. Uh, it's really, I think it's really rewarding, you know, to, to, to see these characters that we loved in the first film and like sort of like, you know, really find out that the family and their family together is really the, really the centerpiece of the movie.